The Ritzville. The Ritzville Rush. It's Camp Come Home Day. I'm excited to see Reagan and Josh and hear their stories. It's 720. That means at camp they're running around crazy trying to get their cabin done and uh, out the door. Usually it's by 8 o'clock. So it is weird that it's a Thursday that they're coming home, but they start camp on a Sunday for junior high camp so they can do another camp over the weekend. Today, Javen and I are going to do some yard work. Yesterday, I ended up doing deep cleaning the kitchen instead of yard work, and the Lord knew that I needed this week because I did not want to go into now through the end of August is gonna be I'm not gonna be home the Lord knew I needed this week so I'm gonna hit the road and drink my coffee and keep the day rolling the day's already been rolling <laughs> Right now, I am repotting. I got all of those succulents yesterday, and so I got some aloe vera, um, and I'm repotting them in some little jars, which I think is so cute. Cleaned a little bit more in the kitchen. Oh, I just feel, I feel good. Except the washing machine won't work today. I put a load of towels in, nothing. Won't turn on, it's like there's no power going to it. I feel bad because Muffin's gonna come home to a washing machine that needs fixed. But hopefully, it's a simple thing. Like, it came unplugged, but I can't jostle, I mean, I could jostle it, but I'm gonna wait and let him look at it because it's, you know, I'd have to pull it all the way out. And anyways, I'm gonna give him hubby duty on that one. <laughs> that didn't work. It didn't work out very well. I love you. Javen, how much yard work do you have today? I'm just getting all crazy up in here with my succulents repotting. I'm taking my cur, my jars, and I'm just adding rocks and soil. And then I hope they live. They're supposed to. According to Pinterest, they'll live now. Me and Pinterest don't always, aren't always copacetic, but I said a prayer over them. I repotted an aloe plant one time and that didn't work out so well. But it was so overgrown, like it, I think it was already starting to die. But anyways, we'll see. We have this big, I don't know what it is, lilac bush that has gone over the fence to our neighbors. So <laughs> Javen is clipping. Ah. Nice job, Bubby. Love you. Going back in. Shamoy la hole. <laughs> well, we're wrapping it up. I don't want to. It's time to go home. No! 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 no. There's always next week. Oh wait, that's senior high camp. I'll be here. Did you girls have a good time? Yeah. No. They took our flag because I have to leave. That's very sad, but you have to reuse the flags, babe. All right, well, the girls are grabbing their stuff. They're putting it in the van. And then we're gonna pick up the boys, grab their stuff, and then we're gonna head on out. I do have to make sure that I get our keys back to the, the people. Otherwise, they'll call me and say, hey, where's the keys? I'll be like, hey, I'm in Ritzville. <laughs> so, bittersweet, but it was a good week. All right. All loaded up. And I think we're just waiting on some girls. Yeah. They still going potty? Oh my goodness. Yeah. Come on. Those take Come on, girls. Come this way. Hurry it up. up Hurry it up. All the youth pastors are getting ready for the Ritzville rush. What is that? That's where everybody tries to get out as quick as they can Hashtag. so they can get to Ritzville first yeah. and not be stuck in a huge line for Hashtag lunch. Hashtag title of the vlog. The Ritzville. The Ritzville rush. All right. Who had a good time at camp? Woo! We're gonna have to wait till after Ritzville to put the uh, the car up. cam up. I kind of forgot to Josh. charge it last night. I was so happy I jumped off the high dives with nice. the GoPro footage. I know, good job, yeah. Ryan. It hurt my butt. <laughs> it did. Yeah. Are you not gonna eat the meatball soup anymore? Nope, never. Okay. I never ever. You, you know I haven't had a camp meal at all since then. Really? Did you guys see me at any meal? Yeah. You didn't have a salad bar or anything? No. Nothing. No salad bar, no nothing. Josh, no. I got a bag of tortilla chips and some crackers. And just have been munching on that and Gatorade. 
<laughs> I'm about to get all crazy up in here. I do not have stain for the wood that I bought, which I really didn't want stain, but it was expensive to buy the stain. It was more than the wood. And then I remembered that somewhere in the history of my Pinterest days, I saw that you could stain wood with coffee. I made some Starbucks espresso coffee and I'm gonna give it a shot because I actually don't want it where it's really stained. I want it where it looks more natural, but I don't want it where it's quite this like just raw. So I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm excited. <music> Okay, here's a little before and after. I don't know if you can see it well, but there's the before, which I love this piece of wood that I got. It put it this perfect stain color that I wanted. I'm very happy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Those are my jazz hands, by the way. Look at that, I love that piece of knotting in the wood. DIY day. Javen, how's that, uh, al how are those allergies after yard work? It is going great. <laughs> Why do you call it here when I stop sneezing and, and dies? And... No, he really, the allergies and doing the yard work, but that's just life. Yeah. Okay, we're taking lunch break. Come on, bud. Uh -huh. So, we are here, here in Ritzville. Hey, our gas light just came on. That's advantageous. Well, at least it came on 30 miles to empty. Yes. Abel. I see Abel. Hey, you're yeah. going to see a lot of people from camp here. The Ritzville yeah, Rush. Like Boy, did we land right in the middle of it. It took a long time to get a burrito and a coffee, that's for sure. And now I got to go get gas. Thankfully, it looks like some bays just opened up because even trying to get an open bay for gas can take quite a while. This is a big hub on Western Washington on the highway. Eastern Washington on the highway. But I found a spot. Noise. songs by Amy Grant. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> I'm just calling to let you know that I have your daughter. Oh, thanks. If you would like to see her ever again, you need to meet me at the church at 4 p.m. with a briefcase full of sour cream. Wow. <laughs> and I need you to leave it under the mat on the south door. Wow. What happens if I don't? Click. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan? Yeah? How long until we get there? An hour. About an hour. Mm -hmm. Oh, we I trained, trained him. Ryan. Trained him well. <laughs> We're about 30 miles away. Girl. 72 out awesome. Dutch. You're banned from looking no. at that screen. <laughs> no. <laughs> See the screen right here, everybody? Ryan has read aloud the temperature every 30 minutes for the entire ride. So I have banned him from looking at that screen. <laughs> Ryan, what, what temperature is it? 72. Thank you. You are banned, child. Oh, no, it's 84 out. It says the temperature <laughs> on the screen. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> See, it's just um, that sign right there. Let me get out and cover it up. <laughs> All right, here we are. Here we be. We be here. Oh, Josh, we're getting us here safely. Yeah. Thank you, yep. Thank you. Thank you, Dad. You betcha. So everyone's been picked up and everybody's headed on home except for my daughter. And her friend. And her friend. Because Mandy's coming to pick him up. I call Mandy and she says, oh, I'm just gonna be like a, one of the, you know, the parents that's late this time. This isn't late, this is like, she is dead last. It's only been 12 weeks. Everyone is yeah. gone. And in reality, <laughs> it means she didn't miss you. Oh. She used to say you loved me. <laughs> I didn't know that was a lot. In reality, it means your mother did not miss you. Yeah. She's, um. Yes, I'm not mom right now. Wow, Shad. Well, I gotta say, it feels a little weird being back in Bertha, being so low to the ground in my minivan versus Vanessa, the super tall van. So that means I'm ready to get a few days rest here and then head right back to the same camp for senior high, which next week I'll be taking my son instead of my daughter, and Mandy will be coming as well. And then we have kids camp after that. Mandy grabbed Amanda and Reagan, has taken Amanda and dropping her off at home, and I'll meet up with them in a bit. I had to put my stuff in my office. I didn't take anything out or unpack anything. I'm just gonna unpack the bare essentials over the weekend. Leave all the gear packed away and ready to go for the next camp. Anyway, finally headed home.